What is going on guys? It's your Jeff Franco01 and today we're gonna to be verifying if StockX, the app, is legit. I'm not sponsored by them. I would have to disclose that information according to the Federal Trade Commission. So by law, I have to tell you guys if this video is sponsored or not, which it is not. I'm a small channel. Who Who's gonna to wanna to sponsor me? But I did want to make this video because my last video was uploaded in 2017. And if I want to keep my channel on life support, I'm going to do yearly videos, not daily content. And that's for one specific person out there and you know who you are. Anyway, I recently ordered my first pair of shoes off of StockX and I want to tell you my experience while ordering these shoes. Find the shoes were simple. Found a pair that I liked and it was a simple process to order. Nothing complicated. Plus they have a feature where you can pay monthly over a period of 3, 6 or 12 months so you don't have to spend a lot of money up front. Shipping for me was about $14 so keep that in mind when you're ordering your pair of shoes. Now I know most of you know this but for the two people who don't, when you buy a pair off of StockX you don't know who the seller is. Also the seller doesn't know who the buyer is. The way that works is that the seller sends the shoes to StockX, then StockX verifies if it is the shoes that you bought and they're legit. After that, StockX sends you the shoes and you can put them on your feet. Now that we have the boring stuff out the way, let's get into the shoes. I ordered the Pure Boost DPR LTD shoes. Also, one thing you should keep in mind is the first time you register an account with them, you will get 14 days to get $20 off your shoes or any other product, but you can only use this once. The shoes I ordered were 70 bucks, but with the $20 off that I just mentioned, I got them for 50 bucks. They were retail $170, so I basically got less than one third of the retail price. When I opened the box, I got one StockX sticker and a thank you card. The card basically tells you to share your shoes with the tag on social media with the hashtag StockX. My photos that I uploaded are on my Instagram page. If you want to check them out, they're in the description below. Please follow me. Now let's check out if these shoes are legit. Even if they were verified, you would want to double check it yourself. Basically check the box. It should have a PO number and that number should match both shoes. The shoe should have the number under the size. For me, it was under the tongue of the shoe. If they match, great, you got yourself a new pair of shoes. There are other things to check to make sure if the shoe is right, like the stitching, the boost material, etc. But that's something you have to learn over time. It's not really something I can personally teach you. There are other videos that can explain it better than I could ever try to attempt and plus each shoe will be different depending on which shoe you get, which version of the shoe, etc. So try to do your own research on that specific shoe that you want. See all the little things that you can check like the stitching and everything else I just mentioned and make sure you get the best quality shoe you can get for yourself. So basically that's gonna be the end of the video. Short, simple and sweet. Straight to the point. I don't gotta extend the video for a 10 minute mark to try to get a monetization because I'm no longer being monetized so I can go straight to the point and make quality over quantity. So I don't have to stretch out the videos, put a lot of buffer, etc. Which is exactly what I'm doing here. But that's besides the point. I enjoyed StockX. I think they're legit. Uh, if you guys have any other tips or have your own story about StockX, put it in the description below. I want to hear more about it. See, you know, what I should be looking into when I buy my new pair of shoes off StockX. Because I will be ordering more shoes off of them. And probably some other apps that I might or might not review. I'm going to have to check that out. But I hope you guys enjoyed. And I'll see you all later.